Preparations are being made for a national festival, the September 27th Fate of Mescal. Mescal flowers are used for decoration and stripped from branches that will be burned in a tremendous bonfire. People will move into the city from miles around. Excitement is building. This will be a day-long affair that will last into the night. There is a mustering of the military for the expected appearance of the emperor, who will officiate at the opening of the pageantry. Ethiopians enjoy complete freedom of religion, but they are a devout people, and this is a celebration of great significance. The celebration of Mescal commemorates the finding of the cross on which Christ was crucified by the Empress Helen, the mother of Constantine the Great. Another version of the story suggests that it refers to the recovery of the true cross from the pagan Persians. The rites of the occasion will be observed by the burning of the Demera, or great fire, which will be touched off by the emperor. And now the emperor arrives. Haile Selassie, the man who succeeded in abolishing slavery in the country, who modernized farming methods, who developed Ethiopian aviation, the man who built new roads and schools. It was Haile Selassie who granted a liberal constitution giving Ethiopians the right to vote for the first time in history. Haile Selassie, defender of his nation. Truly, in the eyes of his people, the personification of the Lion of Judah. With a burning mescal torch called a chibo, the emperor ignites the demera, a ceremony that officially starts the festival. The fire of the demera roars upward into a flaming symbol signifying that the mescal is being celebrated. Such fires will be burning all over Ethiopia. Bands of the Ethiopian army and the imperial bodyguard strike up, and the parade begins. symbolizes great courage, the virtue they admire the most. parade goes by, with some of the marchers unable to repress their own enjoyment of it. These are enthusiastic and vital people. This is a nation that has thrown off the inertia of the past for the hope of the future and in the process has turned Ethiopia into a stimulating and valuable experience for all who visit it.